Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. So in this live, you can see we have two users names. So first of all, I just log in with the first user name. Okay, as you can see, now what I have to do, just search for the IAM in the search bar and click on IAM and now just copy the second username and uh, and in the IAM just search for the second username like this okay so this is a second username as you can see uh, 12b and 12b like this so what you have to do just click on this uh, pencil icon and then click on this add another role scroll down a little bit copy this thing make sure you do not copy that full stop copy that come over here and paste kubernetes engine cluster admin and from here select this click on save one more thing guys this lab take time to update a score as you can see if i just add all the things and if i just click on check my progress it sometimes take time to update a score so do not worry about that if you have just perform all the steps and not getting a score okay so if you just click on multiple times on check check my progress you will get a score okay now what you have to do okay now just scroll down a little bit here you will get grant a service account user i am role like this over here just scroll down and first of all just go to the service account and from here just click on this first one now click on the permission tab then click on grant access now from here again copy the username to paste over here and choose this one now copy this service account users and click on add another role click on that and paste and from here choose the second option now this task also take time to update a score okay so if you if you want you can just wait or un, until you can just uh, move ahead the next uh, task so now what you have to do now we have to log in with the second username so just click the right click over here click in incognito window now copy the second username and paste over here okay now copy the password paste over here and click on i understand so now we have login with the second username okay if you want you can just confirm with from here if i just like this okay now click on i agree I agree and now just search for kubernetes over here click on kubernetes cluster now just scroll down a little bit and copy this name standard user one cluster make sure you do not copy that comma now click on create from here to standard click on just wait for a few seconds and now just replace the name over here like this and choose the us central one a and now simply click on create now it will take few minutes to create the kubernetes cluster so just wait for that meanwhile you can do one thing just go to your first username then click on activate clear cloud shell and just wait and one thing you can do just click on check my progress you will get a score over here as i said it takes time to update the score okay so now just wait until this uh, kubernetes is created properly
so now it's finally completed now what we have to do just come over here copy this command and we are in now first uh, username from here you can just confirm it. okay so now just run the command now copy this command run over here and copy this one and run click on authorize and now we don't need of a second user id yeah so just scroll down copy this paste then copy this paste copy this paste and copy the final one and paste so it's done if you just click on check my progress it take time to update a score so do not worry about that if you don't get a score on this task okay oh, so i have already got it so no worries now just scroll down a little bit and here please pay attention copy from here to here make sure like this okay and copy this first username and paste over here and make sure there is one extra space let me just increase the text size to, so that you can understand like this here you can see there is a extra space over here you can just do the, all the things directly or you can just copy this and paste your notepad and then try it okay now just copy this command run over here then copy this and run so it's done just simply click on check my progress do not worry about that error because it takes time to update the score so it's done now this is the final task that we have to perform copy and paste copy and paste So it will take few minutes so just wait for that
So it's finally done. Now what you have to do, just simply click on check my progress for last task and yeah, we will be done. Sometimes it takes time to update the score, so do not worry about that. If you uh, guys have any doubt, please let me know in the comment section. Thanks for watching guys and have a good day.